Hey guys, it's Mary. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review on the Etude House Fixing Pin. So I got it in this box right here. Wow! It's nila actually from Korea. And uh, I ordered this online. Unfortunately, wala pa siya sa Pilipinas. I really wanted to get my hands on this product because of the no mass transfer claims of this lip product. I decided to get all the five shades. So this retails for eleven dollars and fifty-two cents, so around five hundred fifty-five pesos. I also got this lip and eye makeup remover from Etude House as a freebie. So I'm going to do swatches on my arm and also on my lips to see the color payoff. And I'm also going to do a wear test for up to six hours to see if this is really non-transferable. So we will see how this fixing tint will perform for the rest of the day. I'm also going to bring you guys along with me since I'm going to do some errands outside with my Juma or Chanel. <laughs> also, if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and click that bell button so you will be notified every time I post a new video. So now, if you want to know more about the Etude House Fixing Tint, please keep on watching. So this is how it looks like. So when you open it, it actually kind of looks like a perfume or like a sanitizer mini handy spray. So it has a foot dough applicator. It claims that it's a hydro matte tint. 60 seconds after application, zero transfer. It's smudge proof. It's also weightless. It's a no mask transfer. I'm going to swatch it now so we could see all the shades. So this is their first shade. It has a velvety powdery finish to it. It feels lightweight on my lips. So I'm going to wear a mask now to see if this is really uh, transfer proof. Medyo malaki lang yung mask ko. <laughs> In fairness, Walang bakas besh. <laughs> it has no transfer. Nothing. Na ah. Nadza. Nay nay. Nay nay han. Nay nay. What is she? So we'll see if up to 6 hours nandiyan pa rin siya. So I will observe if nagta transfer or nagsa smudge ba yung lip product sa mask after 6 hours. Babalikan ko kayo. Hey guys, I'm back after six hours. So my final thoughts about this product. I actually like this uh, fixing tin. It's not overly matte. And I actually like the formulation. It's very blendable. Napansin ko lang it tends to cling on the dry patches of my lips. So if you have a very dry lips, I suggest you use a lip balm first. About after two hours of using this product, napansin ko na it did transfer, but not too much. Uh, I think there's just a bit residue, hindi siya yung parang all over the place na kalat. Medyo napansin nyo dito sa mask ko, may, mayroon siyang onting residue. Ayan. If you will ask me if I will buy this again, definitely I will use it again. Actually, nasa makeup bag ko na siya. Lastly, value for money. For me, I'd say I'll buy this again because I feel like it's very long lasting. Unless na lang you ate something oily, which is very common na talaga mahupula siya. But other than that, I actually like the product. Yeah, so that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye! <laughs>